Love smarter, not harder. Today's question. I've been dating my boyfriend for almost two years and I realized I'm not the same person I used to be. I'm having a hard time opening up and expressing my feelings. Seems like we have a great connection, but our communication isn't so great. How can we improve that? I want to be more clear when something bothers me or when I need something from him. I also want to show him that I care about him, but because of past experiences, I've forgotten how to show affection and attention. I'm always grumpy and sometimes I take my anger out on him when he does things I don't like. I tell him I love him, but I know actions speak louder. So I think the short answer is at about two years in, you're starting to take each other for granted a bit. And that's very common, but we don't want to do that. We want to do what I wish I'd come up with this term, but I love it. Date your spouse and know you're not married, but you want to continue to date each other, meaning put your best foot forward. And also because you're not yet married, and I don't know if that's your goal, but if you are, if that is your goal, the dating experience, this relationship that you're in now is laying a foundation for how you intend to treat each other for the rest of your life. And it's really important that you lay a foundation of mutual respect of bringing the best of you to this relationship. It's so easy to take out our anger, like you were mentioning, on the ones we love. We often hurt the ones we love most, the most. We don't want to do that. We don't want, we want to have an extraordinary and epic relationship. And that really starts with being very intentional. So again, the short answer is we need to not take each other for granted. Another layer of support may be to get some couples therapy. My brother offers those. He's a psychotherapist and a pastor and he offers those. You can go to my website, loveandlifemedia.com and book a consultation with him. He's worked with couples for over 30 years and that's one of his areas of specialization. And yeah, you mentioned communication. There are certainly some tools and strategies that could help you be more effective at communicating respectfully and appropriately with your partner. So you may want to take advantage of that. Also, I have a podcast episode, episode 135, that talks about core values. And communication is one of them. We need to be aligned with the way that we want to and the manner in which we communicate with our partner. And again, this is all fixable. And you can get that excitement back and treat each other with that enthusiasm that you did when you were first dating, it's gonna take some discipline. It's gonna take you going, you know what? Okay, stop a moment, don't take it out on him. And reminding yourself, what did you do initially that was, what did you do to communicate affection and appreciation? And what did you do in the early days of dating? Harken back to that and try to bring that energy back. Because I think so often we, lose that that excitement because we just let the day-to-day -day elements of life taint our enthusiasm for one another and we take each other for granted and I know you don't want to do that. So I hope that's helpful.